All right, <clears throat> two-minute drill. Keith Wilson, a lawyer uh, out east, has um, appeared on Viva Frey's YouTube. It was picked up by the Farmers Forum and very encouraging news. A judge has ruled that the convoy was legal. Their protest was legal. Of course, we knew that. Um, but here's the thing. Uh, it, that's fantastic news, and that should be a springboard to accountability. We absolutely need to have accountability and responsibility when our politicians, when our elected leaders fail to live up to their obligation, fail to live up to their oath, and when they break the law, and when they trample our charter rights and our constitution because the prevailing narrative is, is guiding them, um, they're breaking the law. They need to be held accountable. They need to be held responsible. When they arrest people for protesting legally and lawfully, they need to be charged with a criminal offense. It's, the responsibility is shared also with the police. The police who are taking orders and accepting orders and directives from the politicians who are breaking the law, the police are also breaking the law. I've had that discussion with police officers when they stopped people from entering a church, which is goes against the Charter of Rights and Freedoms. It also goes against criminal law in Canada. They were breaking the law. So these people need to be held accountable once judges start ruling in our favor. And we need to make sure that they're held accountable under the law, that they be sentenced, they be convicted and then sentenced uh, for breaking the law. It doesn't end any way else.